Hi, I'm John Chance, and I run the National Engineering and Technical Operations Organization for Comcast Cable. It's a great question. When uh, you know, I think about innovation uh, over the years, and in particular, when I think back, perhaps more than ten years ago, uh, innovation was you know more exclusively done within a company, and more exclusively done on particular vertical integrated systems. And nowadays, when I think about innovation, it's almost more of an industry initiative, not a company initiative. Uh, the second thing that I think about is that innovation now happens on top of other innovations, which I think, in, in effect, is accelerating the pace of innovation in our industry. It's a great question. I'm not, I'm not sure what you mean by rules, but I, I would say, you know, short of uh, you know, any of the being careful of intellectual property and respectful of those kinds of things. I like to think of innovation as boundaryless, whether that innovation is within a corporate setting or it's in an entrepreneurial setting. Uh, having had the good fortune to not only uh, be at Comcast today, but also uh, have been a part of a startup company and a startup division, uh, I really think that boundaryless type thinking uh, is very helpful in getting folks to think out of the box, break the model, create shifts that are, in fact, disruptive. It's a great question. I think, you know, stimulating American business at all sizes and levels would be a great way to keep pushing innovation in our country. We've been an innovative leader across the globe, and I think that needs to continue. That would be a key ingredient. The other is to ensure a level playing field as much as possible across the globe, uh, where intellectual property and things that uh, are shared values across the entire planet. 